Hello everyone, this is Mrs. Wynn from Link 12. I'm going to show you how to do a split screen with the NWEA map testing session on your left and your WebEx session on your right. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is you need to put a couple apps in your dock. You need to put WebEx and you need to put Google Chrome. Now, if you do not have Google Chrome, you are going to go up to the self-service app and find Google Chrome and install it. Then, when you get your apps, you will put them on the dock, and I will show you what that looks like. So, I will take them off the dock by holding down and dragging them. Now I will put the apps on the dock. What you do is you hold your finger down on the app until you get this weird message and you keep holding and then you drag it down and you put it on the left side of your dock. And you're gonna do that with WebEx as well. So you have both of your apps on your dock. Now, before we get started, we are going to make sure that Chrome is your default browser. So I'm going to go into my settings gear and I'm going to scroll down from the top until I find Chrome. And here it is right here. When you click on Chrome, you are going to allow cross website tracking and you're going to make Chrome your default browser. So make sure you pick Chrome. Okay, when you are done with that, you're going to open up WebEx first. You're going to have a conversation with your teacher and then your teacher will give you the link in the chat. I'm gonna to go to my chat and I'm going to click on the link that my teacher has given me and press open. It will open up in Chrome and you're going to press continue. Now you are in the NWEA map testing login screen. Now in order to do the split screen, you're going to slowly pull your dock up from the bottom and you're going to hold the WebEx icon and you're going to drag it either to the right or the left until you see it splitting the screen and then let go. Then you can grab this slider button in the middle and drag it over a little bit. And now you are ready to go. Wait for the login information that your teacher is going to give you. Good luck.